One of my favorite trends right now are the fascinator hats, also known as cocktail hats. You can wear them to weddings, birthday parties, or just any special event. I feel that they complete any outfit. You can find a huge selection of them right here in Key West at the store with over 2,000 hats, also known as the Mad Hatter. Dorcas, thank you so much for being on the show and bringing all of these fabulous hats with you. Thanks for inviting us, Jenna. Well, well it's wonderful it. having you here. And, and Dorcas, how popular is the Fascinator hat right now? Well, the Fascinator took off and went crazy after mm -hmm. Kate Middleton, of mm -hmm. course, um, were them, you know, and the wedding mm -hmm. went mm -hmm. crazy. And we, we carried them for about a year before that. So mm -hmm. designers started making a few, but when when she, you know, when the royal wedding went on, mm -hmm. it just went crazy. It so, went to a whole nother level. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And um, I just came back from New York mm -hmm. on last weekend, so you're still seeing the fascinators mm -hmm. are out there coming for the new spring summer, mm -hmm. um, 2013. So, okay. so it's the still trend isn't going trend. anywhere. No, okay. no. And I think it'll be another couple of years at least before it goes yes. down. So you guys have such a selection, of course, at Mad Hatter. And if people aren't into the Fascinator hats, you've got everything. You've got dressy hats. You've got outdoor hats, men hats, everything. Right. We have hats for men, women, children, um, even the dog. <laughs> so we really? have a few dog hats. Yeah, the Very fun cute. stuff and um, little visors. Um, but we have every price point, things from eight ninety nine up to probably six, seven hundred dollars. Um, we bring in derby hats. Um, so um, this year I usually pick one thing a year that's my gotta have it. Mm -hmm. um, that's a higher price point that I'll bring in and this year is going to be a Christine Moore uh, derby hat that's fantastic. Um, oh, that, that's gorgeous. So yes, it's all handcrafted and I work with her to pick out um, colors and um, trimmings where she might have it on one hat and I'll pick a style and then the trimming. So we'll have one of a kind um, hats. And of course, you don't want to go to the Derby and run into somebody wearing the same no. hat mm -hmm. as you are, you know. Mm -hmm. um, and that happens when they just buy, um, you know, the ones that are at the, at the department stores that are just sitting on the shelf. So, okay. um, so we try to specialize in that. This is, um, I didn't bring the big Derby hats, but this is an example of one of the artists, um, this is Louise Green from California, but it's just, you can see the workmanship. It's like a piece of art with mm -hmm. the feathers and, you know, all the fabric and that kind of thing. But that's um, one of the designer pieces. It's and then absolutely gorgeous. This is, this is Eric Javits of New York. Mm -hmm. um, packable hats, which are very important nowadays, mm -hmm. but it's very stylish um, as well. And he makes Perfect bags to go with that it. match, and Gorgeous. he also makes sandals, which are really, really comfortable. Do you carry um, all of that at the store, Dorcas? Yes, okay. all of these, and we have them in many colors, and mm -hmm. um, some with trims, some with not. So mm -hmm. we have, you know, different things that's um, casual. This is some of the new colors that's coming out with um, Helen Kaminsky, who's an Australian designer. Mm -hmm. So this hat is all hand woven. Um, some of her pieces, some um, they hand weave it and it takes a week. Not this particular hat, but some of our other um, more creative pieces. Mm -hmm. And this hat is easy to roll. Mm -hmm. You very can pack casual. that in a suitcase, uh, yes. Yeah, easily no stick it in your beach bag, mm -hmm. bring it out. Um, but this is uh, one of her new colors. Okay. Dorcas, you've been around for how many years now? Um, we just celebrated our 15th year anniversary uh, mm -hmm. this year. So, Congratulations um, thank on you. that. And now, Dorcas, I'm sure that in the 15 years you've been there, one of the most common questions you have to always hear from people is, what do I do? I, I don't look good in a hat. I think a lot of people, uh, a lot of women especially, um, you have to have a lot of self-confidence to wear a hat because you get attention mm -hmm. when you wear a hat. Mm -hmm. um, so I think that's a little bit of it. But we teach people, um, you know, show them which hats look good on them. It, it's a hat for everyone, but it depends on the shape of their face. Um, if they have a round face, you want to put a round crown on top of them because they just, you know, it gives them a donut effect. Mm -hmm. So you want more of a, a flat crown. Um, if somebody is um, broad shoulder or a little heavier, 
um, or a tall person, you want a bigger brim on them. Mm -hmm. um, because it, it just complements their whole outfit and um, can level off, you know, their body structure. Mm -hmm. And so there's things that we do and my employees, we have, um, I have some employees that have been with us for eight years, um, five years, that kind of thing that, you know, I've taught them how mm -hmm. to work with people and that kind of thing and um, and that's hard to find in Key West right, and have right. people that long right. but um, also there's a lot of people with small heads mm -hmm. so we custom fit mm -hmm. hats for them and that's an important factor as well mm -hmm. okay. so um, so that's so you've got you've yeah. got the tips for people and you can help them right. work and find the right one for their head right. and hats complete any outfit I think whether it's a fascinator or any of the other hats you have Dorcas, thank you for being on the show this morning, sharing your hats with us, sharing your information about the store. Hopefully everybody can check it out. And I know, Dorcas, you have an event coming up in February. Yes. A fashion show? It's a fashion show for mm -hmm. the Lower Keys mm -hmm. um, Women's Club. And um, it's going to be at the Double Tree. Mm -hmm. And it's on February 7th. Okay. Yeah. Wonderful. Well, for any, more for any more information, just check out the information you see on the bottom of the screen. Thank you again, Dorcas. All right. Thanks, thanks for having us. I'm going to take a quick break right now. I'll be right back after these messages with Pete from Peppers of Kiwa. Stay with me.